good evening everybody and welcome to another video um, please like my channel please subscribe and please like this video in this short video we're going to look at how to create an original unique facebook post image for your timeline okay uh, we don't want to share any images uh, we want to create our own image and you know create a post and post it on our facebook wall so we can seem original and not just copying and pasting stuff now we can do this a couple of ways but the way we're going to look at we're going to go to a site called a site called a site called canva i love this site um it's amazing and it makes us do a lot of things very easily now you have to just create an account here it's pretty straightforward and once you log in, um, it will give you a couple of different sizes. You can see it's giving us sizes here. All right. Um, and we want to do a Facebook post image. So we can do a Facebook ad if you want to run Facebook ads, a Facebook cover, you can create your own cover. Instagram post, create your own Instagram posts. Letter YouTube thumbnails. You see all them guys, they fancy thumbnails. You can do your own thumbnails here. Okay. You can just create your own thumbnail. Um, I just created this one, <laughs> um, but we're looking at the Facebook post, and we can see it's seven, it's 940 by 788 pixels. So that the size is 940 by 788 pixels. We're gonna click here, and this is all online, um, create online, so you don't need to download any software to be able to do this. Um, your Facebook post image all right it already gave us some examples here so well, we want to create our own um, we have our elements on the side here so elements our text we have free and paid text uh, our background and upload so if we, so if we can upload from our computer all right so we're going to upload from our computer so what we want to do from here is we want to we can do background, just like whatever we want, whatever we like. You can see change the background. We can leave that, um, and then we can add text, just drag and drop, and click inside of it, and it's going to open up. And you can also uh, move this around just by hovering your mouse over. You can see it's moving around the text. You can make it bigger by opening it up again. Um, we can take an image. It disposes that image here. And just like that, we move it around. And as you move around, you'll see um, some guided, some guides kind of play you when you're centered, which is pretty cool. Um, we can write a text here. can change the color here as well if you like you can just highlight it go to a color palette we can change whatever color we want we can do it to white and click outside the box and, and that's the body you can see it's white um we can also add so if we're going to add a car we can add a car here and you have you see outlines uh, we can just move it down. Where bulls that signs up. Let's so say just hover the mouse over. All right, and you can see we have a nice image there. Um, and and uh, once you once you finish with this, what you can do with this, you can uh, just click here, add heading, and you can you can name it. So I can name this um, and hit done, and that's it. You see, download, and you're good to go. You know, once you download the C computer, you go on your Facebook wall, you start to write a post, click on the image, so upload your image, 
and that's it. The image will be there. Um, so that's how easy it is to create a image for your Facebook post. Um, it's pretty straightforward, as I said before. You can also upload your own images. As I said, just click upload, upload your own images. I'm gonna click this, and it's going to uh, go into your computer, just like any other image you're trying to upload. You search for the image you want. Same thing when I upload. Um, let's bring this motorcycle in. Actually, no, let's bring. Let's see. Let's see what we can bring in. Let's bring in this watch. Let's bring this watch in. As you can see, a uh, watch is imported. You can see all of the little ducky swing across. So, uh, and there's our image. We can grab it. So we can grab it, and here it is. We can just make it smaller. And we can put it wherever we want. All right. I click outside the box, and that's it. All right. Click on it again, and it make you move it. And if you want to get rid of these things, you just over drag him. And just that's it. <laughs> it's gone. Within everything the same, it's gone. That's it. And you have a clean canvas, and you can also come back and change this to whatever you want. White, whatever color you like. Black. Um, we can get a white text here. White text on top. And we could do whatever we want with this. Anything, anything we want to do, we can do it. And we can also get a background here. You can see we can do anything we want. We can drag it down. We can leave our heading here. I mean, we can. It's endless what you can do. Let's put our car. Uh, let's see. Let's put a. Let's put a watch up here at the top. So we can put a nice little watch here. Let's move this down. Let's see what we can do here. Let's move this around. Click on the, out, the box outside. We can Let's move our watch down some more. Let's see. Want to leave it like that? We could. Um, and we'll just put our heading. We're heading over here. Um, we can also continue. We can even push this back. Um, arrange and push back. Come on. There we go. Uh, we can move it up all right and there's a watch behind uh, we can still have our heading and we could change the color to let's see blue or we could do it to red let's do red click outside Right, and here we go. We can still drag this down some more. Let's go make our watch stand out a little bit. Make it just like that. There we go. We can add something else if we want. We can put our bullseye back. Just say yeah. Smaller. 
you can play with this as much as you like and create whatever you want. As I said, all you got to do from here is uh, click here and save it. And it's done. And you're all set. And there you go. All right. Um, that's how simple it is to create your own original. Um, you can even you know, add text again. I want to add text over here in the bottom. Add whatever you want. Maybe a quote you want to write a quote for the day or something you know um, I'm just doing so as an example um, you can do whatever you want and that's it that's how easy it is to create your own original image for your Facebook posts. Um, as I said, up to Canva.com. The link is below this video. You can click on it. It's going to take you directly to Canva. It's going to register with your regular email address and sign up and just start making away. All right. And again, just to you know, move this and I'm going to save so we can, uh, it's already saved. So we can uh, make sure it's saved and we're going to hit download. You can even share. Right from right from here, you could share it too. Um, but you have to enable your your uh, social links. So social links here, and it makes you if you have a Twitter or Facebook. Um, and you see, I have mine mine's here already. In it's gonna write a caption, and it'll be right there. So I can. Uh, it's gonna show you exactly how it works. And I'm gonna hit done. I'm gonna hit share. You're gonna see what happens. And we can view it directly in Facebook from here. So I'm gonna click here. And I'm gonna go to my Facebook page. And you should be able to see this image. On my Facebook, there it is right here. Voila, and just like that, just like that. That's how easy it is to get your image. Just like that, it's already here. Um, it's ready to get likes, ready to get even more shares, and so that's it. That's how simple it is. You can have share buttons. You can share it, comment on it. And this is all done from inside Canva. See my text that I wrote here. I can edit my text. Edit my text. Um, I'm gonna edit here and add. Let's see here. Pin posts. Let me edit it. Let's see. Yeah. I'm gonna edit here. Um, select where to go. Let's go to the site just to grab this link and I'm just going to post it there and go to the men's section and watch it. Collections. As you can see, this watch is right here. So as they come to the site, they're going to see this watch right away, just like that. There goes the link. Done editing. All set. <laughs> it's it's done. Um, and you can share this in a group. Let's pick a group to share this in. Um, I'm just gonna pick a group. And let's see here. Share in a group. Uh, buy and sell. The buy and sell group. Uh, 
should see by itself, by itself. Bias markets, let's click find a group bias market. No posts. That's it. Let's uh, post share another group. That's also how you share your, your posts. Um, let's see, share in a group. Um, I'm gonna pick any group. Let's see. Um, five. Let's see. Find cell. Let's see posts. That's it. I just post in those two groups, and that's it. I'm gonna click here. Go to my timeline and see if it's on my timeline. And it should be there. My timeline. There it is. This is all done from the inside. Canva. All right. So here's Canva. Um, here we are. We can just click this button. And we are done. You can create another one. You can come back. And again, you can play with this. You can do whatever you want. It's up to you. All right. We can get rid of this. All of this. Just drag and drop. You can load one of these templates. And you can make changes to it. You can change the text. You can switch out the image. You can do anything you want. All right. See, everything is done. Don't worry about getting messy. <laughs> it goes back to original. So you want to put this here. If you want to make, you know, make a nice quote. You can do that as well. So again, jump to camera.com or click on the link below to make your own original and unique Facebook image. Thanks for watching and have an awesome, awesome day.